welcome to the FPX Nickel uh, YouTube channel. My name is Martin Turen, President and CEO of the company. I'm joined today by our Chairman and Co-Founder, Peter Bradshaw. Peter, nice to see you again. Yeah, good, good morning, buddy. And we're here today to describe the results of a news release uh, issued by the company on November 15th, 2021, which describes um, uh, additional drill results from our van target uh, at our Descartes Nickel District here in central British Columbia. The economics of the project to date have really been underpinned by the mineralization, uh, which has been previously delineated at the Baptiste deposit. That is a PEA stage deposit that we're now moving forward into the early stages of a preliminary feasibility study. This past summer, we concluded a maiden drill program at the Van Target, which is located six kilometers north of Baptiste, which we believe represents another high potential target for uh, hosting a similar scale a deposit is what we already have at Baptiste, which is the third largest undeveloped nickel deposit in the world. We put out the initial results of holes one and two at Van in mid-October that confirmed a significant new discovery at Van. And we're here today to talk about the results of our new news release, which describes the results of holes three and four. I'll pass it over to Peter here to walk us through those results. Yes, so, uh... As we've emphasized before, before the, the discovery process here at Dakar is based entirely on, on surface rock samples. Uh, because this is a naturally occurring stainless steel, there, there, there is no oxidation cap or, or no, no change in values. Uh, and the, the surface samples, the, the outcrop samples, are our best in, indication of where to drill and what we're likely to, to, to find. So looking, looking now at the sections for, for, for three and four, what we see is we've got, uh, yeah, particularly at the, the top of, of three, a, a extremely good intersection of 287 meters of just on, 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 on 0.12. Per, percent DTR nickel. It's, it's interesting that the top of Four is 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 also the the, the the you know decent grade, but uh, interesting thing thing to note that the entire depth of both holes is above the 0.06 cut cutoff that, that we have for the the, the Baptiste deposit. So now just to ref refresh a bit on on se sections uh, or, or sorry drill holes one and, and two, there. Their best in, in intersections were also up uh, uh, near surface, you know. It, so that trend has has been extended down to to, to three and four. Uh, if you go on our web website, uh, you'll be able to to look at this three D version and be able to, to to spin it and 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 look at it and. You know, get 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 a, a better idea of uh, the overall uh, geography, and and so just just to conclude, this is going back to the the surface outcrop results, and we'll be releasing the results of uh, um, five, six, and seven, and eight, eight, and nine um, as as soon as the results are available. Great, thanks for that, Peter. Um, yeah, it's uh, <clears throat> it's uh, re really great for us to be able to report these results to the market to really confirm the lateral extension of mineralization in the subsurface of the van target, now covering an area of you know circa 400 meters by 400 meters or so. A strong success in all the four, first four initial holes at van. So for an initial maiden program to be successful in all four holes is quite an accomplishment. And as Peter mentioned, we look forward to releasing the results of additional holes in the weeks to come. Uh, as Peter mentioned, please do visit our website, fpxnickel.com, or for any questions, please leave them below this video or email me directly at ceo at fpxnickel.com. Thanks very much for your time.